Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to edit multicam using just one video clip. In other words, I'm going to take this video clip and split it into three. A wide shot and two close-ups. This was shot in 4K using my Canon XA50. It was actually shot in auto iris and auto white balance, basically because we were shooting this outside and the sun was going down. So like I said, this is a 4K video clip and we'll be editing on a 1920 by 1080 HD timeline. First thing you do is you right click, make new compound clip, and we'll call this wide. Do the same thing, new compound clip, and we'll call it left. One more time, and we will call it right. So for multicam to work, you wanna select one of the clips. I'm gonna start with the wide clip, and over here in the inspector, make sure this is on extended, and where it says camera angle, make it camera angle one. I always like to make my wide shot camera angle one. Go to the next one, make it camera angle two, the next one and make it camera angle three. Now select all three compound video clips, right click and new multicam clip. And we'll just call it multicam lesson. Make sure this is 4K, whatever your frame rate was. You can leave all this, use audio for synchronization, hit OK. OK, so now that the multicam clip is made, we're going to Drag it to the timeline, double click, and you see all three angles. But they're all exactly the same. So we'll start with the wide shot. I'm actually gonna zoom this in just a little. That's pretty good. I'm also going to tweak the color some. I want this to look like it was shot at night, so drag the blacks down, drag the mids down a little bit. That looks pretty good. We'll leave it like that for now. Now we're gonna go to the left camera angle. On the left over here, there is a computer screen icon. Click on that, and that will show this angle. So now we're going to push this in about 170, and then position it to where it looks like a close-up. That's pretty good. Now let's go into the right camera angle. Click on the computer screen icon. Get it positioned. And there is our other close-up. So we have the wide shot. We have the left camera angle close-up and the right camera angle close-up. Since I've color corrected the wide shot and I didn't do the, the two close-ups, what I want to do is just select the wide shot, hit copy, and then select the left and the right shots, hit edit, paste attributes, and turn off the transform because we don't want to mess with that. And you're basically pasting the color board. So now all three shots match and they match perfectly because it's basically all coming from the same video clip hit the back button go back in the main timeline and there's your three camera angles and that's pretty much it now you can edit like three camera angles there's your wide shot there's your close up close up and that's it if you want to tweak the audio actually go in and change the audio settings. I won't go into all that. If you want some more in-depth tutorials, I'll leave a link below. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please check out my other channel. That's where I got this video clip from. It's called In The Shed, where we talk about classic rock. We pick our top three classic rock fill in the blank. I'll leave a link to that channel below also. And uh, make sure to subscribe to this channel and like this video. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. And thanks for watching.